This video shows a diorama that has been brought to life by adding lights to change on a time schedule. It is the first in a series on lighting and animating your diorama or train layout. The follow-on videos in this series will cover adding lighting to buildings and roads, a sunrise to sunset effect, making traffic lights, level crossing, arc welders, and fires. So subscribe and click on the bell to stay notified when the next video in the series is posted. In this first video, you will see a building and street light animation for a terminal goods shed diorama. The diorama has two segments. You see the first segments in this video. The second segment is being upgraded. A new building is being added. Plans, kits, and details about making the buildings and diorama are linked below the video. Figures, cars, pallets, and more will be put in place once the second segment is in final form. All lights operate on a 24-hour real-time cycle. The program used to control them allows that time to be compressed to an adjustable diorama time. For the sake of this video, I have set it at about three and a half minutes. For my own shelf display, it is set at 24.5 minutes. An overhead WS2812B pixel LED strip provides sunset, sunrise to sunset lighting. It changes colors according to how the sky would look lighted over 24 hours. In line with that recommended way, to light a model railroad shelf layout, the pixel strip is mounted at the top front of the diorama with LEDs facing away from the viewer and towards the building. Now, let's watch it work. We start at dawn. The street lights are on, businesses close, security lights are on. As the sun rises, the street lights fade off. The staff has come to work. They turned on the interior lights and now they'll turn off the outside security lights. As the sun continues to rise, the colors in the overhead will go through the colors that you would see over a 24 hour cycle. To save time, I'm going to cut the video here and resume the video at dusk so you can see more activity. It's evening now, the sun will set, street light and trackside lights fade on, the staff is going to close the business, they'll turn off the interior lights with exception of one light in the office area that they'll leave on for security, they'll turn on the outside security lights. The diorama will now go through the complete overnight cycle and then it will come back to the dawn and start again. I'll break it here and you can watch that go while I finish up the video. Below the video are links to tutorials on making this diorama, the buildings, lights, scenery and controlling the lights. There are wiring diagrams and parts lists as well. In the next video, I will take you through the process of building the animation control panel. So subscribe to be notified when that is published. If you have comments or questions, use the comments box below. I review and respond every day and I'm more than willing to help you if there's something that you want to do. Please give this a like, it helps. Have a good day and have a good life. Enjoy your modeling and introduce a youngster to the hobby.